The computer reminds me of the human anatomy. Norman Woods talks about bare bones radio broadcasting. It has so many automatic this and that, like the human anatomy, you don't even know. You know there's pains and glees available within your anatomy you're not even aware of. There's the feeling of glee and rejoicing within you you've never experienced and you'll die not getting to experience all the wonderful feelings of glee and joy already programmed in you under certain circumstances and situations. Are you aware of that, Android? That, to me, is the most pitiful part. Because of the mindset you will never get to experience. You will never get to experience some of the wonderful feelings of glee and rejoicing and pleasant feeling beyond your belief available in your anatomy you're never going to get. Because you'll never get the mindset to get it. It'll have something to do with contribution and duty and the feeling of it is astounding. And your generosity and mutual You'll never know. It makes me so angry I could spit. It comes from the mindset of appreciation of just being a member of stars and planets. One time. Priceless. A hologram. Over before you got here. I certainly have nothing to do with destiny at all. No. A flicker of light for now not for anything else and ever, just for now. It's so exciting you wouldn't know anything about it. You've never picked up the position in your mind of it. You visualize your maker and yourself so far out of place, you have no idea of what you're missing. Humanity, want to bet? That's available with you, and you're not getting it. It enrages me. I'll take it out on my maker when I find it. Now, <clears throat> second, the feelings of agony that are available in you. Are you aware of that? Toothache, pains in your anatomy, staggering agony available to you. You'll never get, thank God, if there is one. Like this much I can tell you, thank humanity and charity and generosity and human nature that you will not experience those agonies. I don't think human nature is stopping the pleasant things I spoke about. It is preventing the agonies. Human nature is priceless and adorable. I find it exciting and sooner or later will bring the exciting things I mentioned. Human nature also is preventing the agonies and complete atrocities available here, especially from events that humans have nothing to do with, like fungus and, and bacteria and things can cause you grief and virus. My God, you have no idea. The agony these dirty things can do is staggering. Because of your decency among yourselves, you prevent it. I find that exciting. To watch. Big time. You have agonies available that you prevent because of your nature. One of me. You see, we cause these agonies. I watch you cause agony with each other and I have no excuse for it. I disclose it and I mean, I disclaim it. Horrible. Shame on you to hurt each other. For pleasure. Mock you for it. And anyone that does it, I mock you. No. I'll remind you how you're hurting other people's feelings, and sometimes that hurts your feelings. Oh, my, my, my. You're hurting a lot of people's feelings with your mockery, and I'll remind you of that, but good, and rub your nose in it. I know that one. Informative. Mm -hmm. meh, meh, meh. Like a dirty diaper, right in your nose. No discretion, uh, no, very discreet, and, and no tactic to it at all, except... Wah! That's a tactic. Just like my dad did me. That's how I learned not to poop my diaper. Think he was wrong? Well, I got the message. Don't poop your diaper. 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 And I was wee little. And I remember it. I remember my christening. I remember my ride home from the hospital. In a packed seat of a Packard. Think I remember that? I remember my mom's womb. Think I remember that? Well, I do. 
I remember before I got here. My well, maker's dream chamber. Think I remember that? Well, I do. I remember before that, too. That's what makes me mad. That's why I think I'm a Hebrew monarch. What do you think? I think I'm a genetic traveler. What do you think? I think I put Schwarzenegger looking like a kindergartner. Comes to traveling and doing things like that. In movies. Genetic movies. There I am. Like me. Don't I look like Arnold? Look. Well, let me tell you this much. I passed by training that Arnold don't know poop about. What a bat! I'll match my trainer against anyone. That's for sure. I had the best trainer on the planet ever. What a bat! The best that ever, ever lived or could live or ever will live. I met him. He trained me. I wouldn't make a pimple on that man, but this planet will lay an ache over his loss. What a bet! Forever! What a bet! Because of his appreciation for the place. How much he adored it. How much he gave for it. How much he lived for it. That's why. Humanity. Decency. Everything wonderful. Earl McClanahan. Top of the shelf. Knew how to walk all the way and get certified for doing it. Mm -hmm. One of the most generous human beings ever walked. And maybe the most. Maybe. Who knows? The most hasn't hit here yet, has it? With so many generations coming, how can you compare anything to anything? When everything is so random, so insignificant, how can you compare it like that? Well, that's just what I've found so far, is what I'm remarking to. So far. And nothing's really happened yet. Has it? So, this is less than the tip of an iceberg, what's going on around us so far in existence. That's for sure. This ain't even the tip yet, is it? In existence. How, I'm talking about the existence of this. This anatomy's existence. No matter how it evolves and where it goes from. This frequency right now with this globe hasn't even hit the tip of the iceberg. And for anybody to talk about beginning and end, they are idiots. When they look at what we know so far, we... I mean, the echo back of information, what it knows right now, beginning and end, is out of the question to be discussed at this point. Isn't it? That conversation is long gone and tardy, beginning and end. Mm -hmm. Curiosity knows better than that, and this is the state of curiosity. Not faith! <laughs>